Medicine and chemistry and chemical biology is the chemistry of medicine and life. And specifically, I would like to add that um, medicinal chemistry is the, the foundation of the modern pharmaceutical industry. So medicinal chemists will have skills in analytical chemistry and, of course, synthetic chemistry, among others, um, while they will have a basic understanding of how the drugs function in the body. Studying medicinal chemistry and chemical biology in UCD will give you the best preparation for working afterwards in the pharmaceutical industry or in biotechnology fields, or even go farther and study farther, for example, in the frame of a postgraduate program that might be a master or a PhD, and you can become an academic yourself. I love the lab. That's really where you get to meet people, and science is great for that. You're you do two to three hour labs and you get to meet a lot of people um, and it breaks it down from huge lecture halls and you're getting to meet people one on one and really getting to dig into science. So UCD will start with the first year, then there is a common entry where you will learn the foundation of science, you will learn something about physics, um, about maths, maths is one of the languages of science, of course biology and chemistry. Then starting from there, you go to second year, where you will deepen your knowledge in certain subjects, of course expanding on certain subjects like um, genetics, for example, microbiology, physics, biophysical chemistry, chemistry and biology itself. And of course, then starting from that, we will add up in year three and four, concentrating more on the medicinal chemistry and chemical biology programs. I think it really made me look, um, because medicinal chemistry is all drug related, I'm really looking at the pharma industry, how they carry out processes. You're looking at how you can make it more sustainable, how you can make drugs more effective. And you're really looking at it from a critical point of view and how drugs work and how we've developed from the 1920s all the way up to now, what we're able to do with pharmaceuticals. In the fourth year, the medicinal chemistry and chemical biology students will have uh, also the possibility to um, be embedded in a research group in the School of Chemistry, where for their, they will perform the, their fourth year projects and they will really be part of a research group. And I would say this is a unique experience. Students can take um, placement in industry uh, that is around six to ten weeks in summer. Uh, where they learn to apply their, their skills and what they have learned in lectures in real life. I think I'll, I'll always remember the labs, they were very intimidating at the beginning. You go in and it was all very white and didn't know where anything was. And by the end, I just loved it and you could really just try out things and you really got to embrace science and it was very practical, which not a lot of other courses can offer. So if you really like science, it, you're in um, state-of-the-art labs with brilliant equipment, fun with the demos, getting to meet friends. I loved the, the gaps in between the labs and the lectures because you could go study, you could go to do sports, you could meet friends. And it was just a real freedom that you don't get in school. And I loved being able to schedule my own time to what suited me that day. I would like to recommend this course to students that are particularly interested in both chemistry and biology. I would like to underline the importance of chemistry in this course because, as, as I said, you are a chemist in the end, but with a good understanding of biology. My advice is to keep your options open. You don't necessarily need to have studied the subject before you come here. I studied biology and physics and never studied chemistry and ended up getting a degree in chemistry. So you can do introductory modules and they can build you up from a foundation level all the way to what you need. Once you put the work in, it's possible and it's really exciting.